See, I have this uh, warrant that was put out for me for grand larceny, which I know I'm innocent of a felony that I feel I'm being set up. I never took one dollar in ticket sales for my conspiracy conferences. You know, the conspiracyconferences.com site. I have taken a lot of reservations from people who say they are interested. I never took one dollar. I have this case reopened and it's for child support. That's what this is about. I can't just go out and get a regular job. They'll take, if I, let's say, say I'm making two grand a month, just a regular job, whatever. They take a thousand dollars away. Then they take the taxes out. I've done this. I've gotten a job before. So therefore, I am tens of thousands of dollars behind on child support. And after, you know, can't get a job. So I've got them after me for child support. I've got them after me for um, this grand larceny thing. And they're after me. Also, now I'm sure for a probation violation because of my DUI from two, over, well, two years ago that I failed to appear on. And then I got the ex coming after me for child support for tens of thousands of dollars. They're going to put me under, under the jail. And nobody cares. You know, nobody cares. What the hell, what the hell should I do? Just turn myself in? You know, they're going to slap me with all kinds of other stuff. I, I'm i going to be in jail for a friggin' year or something. I mean, this is ridiculous. I was hoping to make money when I got the conspiracy conferences going. I was hoping that. And, of course, I was going to keep all the money. And, yes, I was asking for volunteers because I am a volunteer until there's actually some money to give somebody. Okay, there's a lot of work that has to be done to make something fly as big as traveling all over the country doing conferences. There's a lot of work that has to be done up front. And I have no money to pay nobody. I have never scammed nobody for a dollar. Never have, never will. My moral beliefs would keep me from doing that. The reason why I got into the truth or movement was to make my mama proud. Do something that actually meant something instead of just selling houses and locking people into payments that they can't afford. It's ridiculous. There's a lot of y'all guys said you were willing to try to help. Okay. Well, I'm going to put the email address to the person you can email and we can all communicate and see how much money we can come together with. My mama would not be proud. <laughs>